All right, folks, fasten your seat belts. This could end up being a very technical, very entertaining fight. I'm surprised they didn't bring out the geese for this one, champ. I mean, you would have thought as a jujitsu watcher that you would see these two competitors at a jujitsu competition. But ultimately, they are meeting in the octagon, and you are about to see jujitsu in the UFC like we've never seen before. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the defender. All combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. There. He's so. Oh! Oh! Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motion wow. on the mat. Actually got the takedown. Gets the single leg takedown. Under three minutes now to go on the round. And he's back to his feet. Good sign for him there. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Side control now. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling should really be entertaining. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground tonight. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. All right, north-south position now. We'll see how he chooses to proceed. Goes upstairs for an elbow. Well, you know, I don't like the gi very much, but I have an appreciation and a healthy one for these type of transitions. You can tell he's been in the gi at some point in his life with the way that he moves so freely. I'm skipping jujitsu next week, too. <laughs> he might get a finish here. Oh, countering, it looks like with a Von flu choke, or maybe we should call it the OSP now, but trying to get out of the guillotine by submitting his opponent. Incredible. Not tapping out tonight. All right, right into side control here, DC. Biggest difference between half guard and side control. Well, side control. So he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the grounded pound will be a plenty from this oh, position. Oh, you gotta watch him attack his submissions. He throws the legs up to try to get a triangle choke here. All right, so a big knockdown for him courtesy of that punch and that. Let's take a deep breath and relax. Your striking is on point. Love the way you're mixing up combinations, just like we drilled in the gym. Good. You ready? You ready? Second round underway. Try to establish that jab. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Big punch from the clinch. Oh, knee to the head. Big power shot there. Oh, man, how is he standing after he ate that knee? He has absorbed so many of them in this round, and now you can visibly see some of the damage that has been inflicted by his opponent. Oh, man, it... Oh. Escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Sound defensively here as he stays upright. Double leg takedown, no good. Oh, nice timely trip there. He's in a world of trouble now. They say the straight on the That is it! He's done, he's done! <laughs> Again, the winner here was so aggressive with his onslaught that ultimately appeared as though the outcome was an eventuality, so 